Uh, the three-year-old fillies are all in and locked up. And they're off. And a very good start. Back to last, though, is Midnight Gem. Not showing much pace. Dropped three behind. And Artie's Princess came out running. Dashed out in front by two lengths and drifted out a bit. And getting away from the inside leads almost three. Tuscan Damsel. Lying in third is Rosie Jewel Dancer. Westpaw going up nicely on the outside. And back on the rail is Wake Up Maggie making ground. And a long last Midnight Gem. The problem with the leader is getting away from the inside. Lugged out there. But Artie's Princess in front. They race along towards the three and a half. Chasing Artie's Princess. Three Length to Tuscan Damsel. Two and a half to Westpaw getting to work. On the outside, Rosie Jewel Dancer. Wake up Maggie coming up the rail. A long last remains Midnight Gem. First quarter was a flyer. 22 and 3. They come to the quarter. Artie's Princess still in full flight. Two and a half to Tuscan Damsel. Two to Westpaw. Wake up Maggie. Into the home stretch. And Artie's Princess the one to catch. Tuscan Damsel giving chase in second. On the outside, Wake up Maggie trying to run home and is starting to make ground. The leader, Artie's Princess, holding clearly. Tuscan Damsel in second. Down to the final 16th there's been no opponents whatsoever and this filly much the best Artie's princess a very polished display head on the chest could have won by so much more three and a half length tuscan damsel then wake up maggie with midnight gem running on late west pour the rail last rosie jewel dance of the time 1891